Hi there, folks, and welcome back this week with another Workspace Wednesday right here on Lean Strategies International, LLC. Now, before we get started, if you'd like more tips on Google Workspace, please hit the like button, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so every week you can be updated with the latest videos and supply chain operations, Google Workspace, and just general tips for you to learn and grow on your continuous improvement journey. So let's get started. This week we're gonna look at how to calculate a percentage in Google Sheets. And so you can see right here in our Google Sheet, we have some sales data and some goal data that was set for each of these item numbers. And what we wanna do is calculate the percentage that our item is towards the goal. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of formatting here to clean it up first. <clears throat> excuse me and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take these two columns because these are dollars and we're going to format them in dollar now you can do it by clicking on the format as currency or we can come up here to our drop downs we can go to number and go down to currency there also to so two separate ways that we can format those columns now that that's done we're going to calculate our percentage in google sheets so the way that we do that, and let's just give it a label here <clears throat> real quick, percent to goal, is we're going to hit the equal sign. Uh, that'll open up a function inside of Google Sheets, and that's what we start all of our functions with. Uh, and then you can see that it's going to give us a suggestion here. It's uh, Google Sheets is guessing that we want to divide B2 by C2, which is exactly what we want to do. So very intuitive, and in this case it's correct. But we're going to go ahead and manually select it. We're going to hit B2, and then you're going to use the forward slash or divide by C2, and we can type that one in, and we'll hit enter. <clears throat> and you can see right there it'll give us 0.2, and then it's going to want to uh, auto-populate all of the rest of them because it's guessing that we want to calculate the same thing for all of them. So you can either hit the check mark or if you didn't want to do it that way, you can go ahead and grab it. And then right here on the bottom right hand corner, you can drag it down and that will populate our percentage for each of them. Now, this doesn't look like a percentage just yet. So we need to format this data so that every time we calculate it, it is a percentage, so we're gonna go ahead and highlight that selection. And remember, we can format this two different ways. We can come right up here to our shortcut, we can click on format, and you'll see that we have percentage now. So on item number one, it's 20% to the goal, item number two is 30% to the goal, 4%, and so on. Or if we want to do it another way, we can come up here to format, click our drop down. we can go to number, It'll open up some more options and we can scroll right down to percent and that'll also give us our percentage. Now if we want to shorten this up <clears throat> and we want less decimal points, we can close that off a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and leave two of them and that's how you calculate a percent in Google Sheets. Now let's try one more just to make sure we've got this down. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and highlight this range right here. I'm going to hit Command C, which will copy it. I'm going to come over to column F, and I'm going to go ahead and paste the exact same thing right there. <clears throat> now let's say that we have a total for our goal, and our total will be right here. This is our goal. So we're just going to go ahead and sum that really quick. We're going to hit our equal sign again, sum and we wanna accept that suggestion. We see it's 25,000. Now, let's say we want the percent uh, to the total goal. So what we would do here, a little bit different, we're gonna go ahead and hit our equal sign to open up our function again. We're gonna select our sales, which is our current sales, to the total goal. And then we're gonna hit our forward slash, which is divide by. We're gonna hit the 25,000, and we're gonna press enter. And we can see that's gonna give us 0.02. Now remember, it's not formatted yet, 
But if we were to drag this down, it would give us a bunch of div errors. Why? Because we need to create an absolute value. So let's go ahead and go back. What we're gonna do is open that up. We can come right up here. Now the one that we need to stay or make into an absolute value is H12. So the way that we do that is we put a dollar sign in between each of these. We're gonna hit enter and we can accept this suggestion. I'm gonna go ahead and X out though because we don't want the total one. And that will give us our percentage there. Now let's try formatting it again. So we're gonna select this range and we can hit percent or if we wanted to do it another way, we can hit format and we can go to number and then we can go to percentage. And so we can see that item number one is 2% of the overall goal. Item number two is 3% of the overall goal. Item number three is a little smaller. It's close to half a percent right there and so on. So that's how you calculate a percentage in Google Sheets and also how you format percentage, um, pretty easy. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. Please leave them down below. We'll read them and get back to you. And I hope you have a great day. We'll see you next week right here on Lean Strategies International, LLC.